Right now, Senator Bernie Sanders is a front runner to win in North Carolina's primary, but could he actually beat President Trump in November? That's the key question some Democratic primary voters are trying to figure out as they determine who they'll pick on Super Tuesday. CBS 17's Capitol reporter Michael Hyland is live in Durham, where he interviewed Bernie Sanders today. Michael. And Sanders held a rally here in downtown Durham today, and just before it started, I got a chance to ask him about some of the big issues that have come up during the campaign. As I've talked to undecided Democratic voters, they say they're still searching for the candidate they feel has the best chance of beating Donald Trump. During his rally, Sanders tried to make the case that's him. In the real clear politics average of polling, Sanders beats Trump head-to-head -head nationally by about four points. But some voters are concerned that as a Democratic socialist, he's too far to the left. I asked him how he responds to them. How would you actually pay for that? No matter who wins the Democratic nomination, and obviously I hope it's me, uh, that all of us are going to rally around the winner because we understand how dangerous Donald Trump is. So I think we're going to win uh, all of, you know, solid Democrats. But I think the real trick to this campaign is who can create the largest voter turnout because to defeat Trump, we're going to need the largest voter turnout in history. I think our message appeals to working people. It appeals to young people. I also talked to Senator Sanders about Medicare for All and specifically how he's going to pay for it. You can see the full interview on the CBS 17 mobile news app. Live in Durham, Michael Hyland, CBS 17 News.